some more. And you know what? What we got to realize is our problem, other problem is we are listening to a fake lion. First Peter 5 and 8, put it up there. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, walks about as a roaring lion seeking whom he may desire. He walks about as a roaring lion. What is he walking about? What? As. Y'all get a camera on my lion. There we go. Uh, he's a mean old lion. But let me hope somebody. He looks like a lion. He roars like a lion. He got a tail like a lion. But this ain't no lion. This is Horus. <laughs> Y'all laughing, but the point I'm making is that you are scared of somebody who ain't even a real lion. Jeez. Jeez. The Bible said he walks about like a lion. You need to tell that lion I ain't scared of you. Slap him and get up. I didn't mean to slap him that hard. <laughs> but that's what you need to do. You need to slap the devil real hard. The Bible says resist him and he'll flee from you. Tell somebody slap that fake lion. Oh God, I guess God had me to slap him real hard to get y'all... Come on, give God a praise. He's a fake lion. Revelation, he ain't a lion. He just lying. Oh, y'all don't, y'all miss that. He ain't a lion. He just lying. The real lion said he's a liar and the father of it. Tell somebody everything he's telling you. It ain't the truth. And he's a fake lion. That's why we can't be scared of the words that come out of his mouth because he really is not a lion. So tell somebody, you need to roar some more. No weapons formed shall prosper. I'm the head and not the tail. Roar. No good thing will he hold from them that walk out for them. I am roaring because he's able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above. Well, if you really believe that, come on, roar, roar, roar. Yeah. 